What's up guys? So about to go to the gym. It's about 7 18 right now. Uh, so I'm gonna first have this granola bar. And then I'm also going to drink a bottle of water before. So I get some good carbs in, get hydrated, and we'll get to the gym. So I'll see you there. So we just got home from the gym. Uh, I made the shake, so I'm gonna drink this now. And uh, after I drink this, it's gonna put me about uh, a little over a thousand calories. So it's only 9:30, so I got a good start in my day. Uh, I'm going for 4,100 calories, maybe a little more if I can. So yeah. So if anyone doesn't know what's in here, it's uh, two scoops of whey protein, chocolate, a uh, cup and a half of milk, uh, two servings of peanut butter, and a banana.
and then I put some creatine in it also. So I'm gonna drink this, and then I'm, uh, I'll see you in the next meal. All right, so I just got home from my grandpa's. I had helped him move a big plant from outside down to his basement that he wanted, so we did that. And then he did uh, make me breakfast, even though I already had it. But that's okay, because I need the extra calories. So I had, he made me uh, three, three slices of bacon, uh, three eggs, uh, two pieces of toast, and I had a glass of orange juice. And he also gave me this vitamin water. It's very good, actually. It's uh, Kai blueberry and pomegranate. So zero calories this time. But, <clears throat> so that's going to put me over about just a little bit over uh, 2,000 calories now. Forgot, he also did give me uh, two venison jerky sticks. So that's gonna put me over about 2,000 calories. All right guys, so I just got done showering. Uh, so I'm gonna have my next meal now. Uh, I'm gonna have some of these power cakes. Uh, they're protein, uh, like waffles basically. And I'm gonna make them with my blender. because It makes it a little easier. So I'm gonna put everything in this cup and then blend it all together. Uh, what goes into it is this, a cup of this, and then I'll put some whole milk and also one egg in there too. So that's going to be for this meal and I'll show you guys how to uh, get this ready. Alright, so I just mixed it up. This is what it looks like. And then we're going to put it into this uh, waffle iron. So hopefully it will come out good because sometimes I overfill it. So we will see. Alright, so that's cooking right now. It takes about four minutes. So I got the timer going right now. So yeah, we're going to wait for that to finish up. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to probably have two of them because I think the serving size is a half a cup of the mix so I'll probably have two of them and I'll let you guys know how many calories and macros and all that. Alright so here's the first one see how it came out. Whoo it's hot. Ooh dang yeah it burnt it a little bit but oh well it'll still be good. Next one will be better. So we're going to make another one. I'll make sure I spray it first. Those things will stick like crazy. Alright. Let's do this one for a few minutes. So yeah, so I'm gonna put some syrup on this to start eating this one, and then I'll uh, eat the second one. Uh, I also didn't log the syrup, so it's probably a little more. So right now, I'm um, a little over 3,000 calories now, so I have about 1,200 1, left. Uh, I also have some extra mix that I can save for tomorrow, so I'm going to put this in the fridge. And yeah, so I will see you in the next meal. Hi right, guys, so I just uh, logged this real quick. Uh, it is, it has another 200 calories. It's uh, about 58 grams of, 53 grams of protein. Uh, there's no protein, no fat, so I mean, it's pretty, it's not terrible. It has 26 grams of sugar, which isn't the greatest but it, adds, it helped uh, add some calories in. Uh, right now it is almost one o'clock and I have a thousand calories left, but I'm probably not gonna eat till for another six hours now because I'm gonna wait till dinner. Uh, I actually have to go to Velpo here soon and you guys probably don't know where Velpo is, but it's about 40, 30 minutes from my house. So. Well, it's raining now and it's very nasty out. It was pretty nice earlier, but Whatever. So I gotta drive about a half hour now. Uh, like I was saying, I gotta drive about a half hour now. Uh, I'm going to uh, my stepbrother's gym. He actually owns his own gym where he trains lots and lots of clients. Clients, and I'm actually gonna be working for him soon, uh, training people there. So I'm kind of going out there, and he kind of just 
teaches me little things like it just kind of shows me the, he's been showing me the ropes for a while now and so i'm gonna go there hang out with him for a little bit and i'll catch up with you guys after that all right guys so i just got home um about to have my next meal first i'm gonna make this uh quinoa and brown rice uh this little packet i just put in the microwave for like i don't know a couple minutes whatever and it makes two cups of uh rice and quinoa so I'm gonna have that. That'll be about almost 100 grams of carbs, so that'll be really good. And then for my protein, I'm gonna have some tilapia. These are like crusted, uh, tortilla crusted tilapia. So I have the oven going, I'm gonna put those in there. And then, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have some of that. And it is done. So I'm gonna eat this first real quick. Two cups of brown rice and canola. So I'll eat that first and then I'll, I'm gonna wait for this oven to get done and preheating and I'm gonna make flop in and I'll eat that. So outside this uh, sparkling water, it is orange mango flavor. So I like to drink these with my dinner or lunch or whatever. It's better than just regular water, I guess. There's zero calories, it's just flavored water with sparkling. So I'm gonna drink this, finish this bowl of rice, and then the tilapia. All right, I finished up that rice. Now I got my tilapia, <clears throat> looks really good. I'm gonna eat this, and then that'll finish up this meal. All right, guys, so I finished the tilapia. I had two of them. Uh, so that's gonna put me at about 4,000 calories. Uh, so I still have 100 more to go, but I'm probably gonna eat closer to 5,000 today, just because uh, I think one or two days this week I did not hit my 4,100 mark. So I'm gonna try and get some extra ones in today, since I it's only 7 something right now, 7 p.m. So I'm gonna have a like a mass gainer shake. It's something I make, I'll show you guys in a little bit here. But it adds a lot of calories and it's uh, nice and filling and that'll probably be my last meal tonight. I'll do that right before I go to bed and I'll, I'll be sure to show you guys how I make it, what I put into it. And if you guys are having trouble like adding calories into your diet, definitely uh, add this into it because it's a game changer. Also, uh, so a lot of people think like Oh, I didn't hit my daily intake. Uh, what do I do now? Well, it's not as like not as much as your daily intake. It's not as important as your weekly intake. I mean, yeah, you might mess up on one day and just kind of cut back on the next day or eat a little more on the next. So like if you're cutting and you ate too much uh, yesterday, uh, I'm gonna cut down a little bit today. Like or like in my case, yesterday I didn't eat enough, so I'm gonna add some more calories today. And it's just over. Like you want the overall calorie goal to be fulfilled. All right, so this is my mass gainer shake. So I'm gonna have some casein protein in it, some whole milk, and two uh, packs of oatmeal. So it's about a cup and a half of whole milk. Like that. I'm gonna do a scoop of casing. And rip these open. So this is my little uh, mass gainer shake I make. Uh, it's, like you saw, I had 
oatmeal and casein protein. And for those of you guys who don't know, I mean, I've told some of you guys before, casein protein uh, is a protein that digests uh, slower. It takes about eight hours to digest. So I like taking this uh, red fiber bed so it keeps like protein in my sin keeps protein in my uh, system while I'm asleep and uh, not intaking any food. So uh, after this, and as you saw, I had a bowl of cereal, apple jacks uh, before this too. Uh, it's gonna put me at 5,352 calories total. Yes, that's very high, but like I said, I had a couple days this week where I was very low and I'm just kind of catching up. I'll put everything at the end uh, about protein, carbs, and fat and how many calories it was in everything. Uh, but this is probably gonna conclude this video here. So uh, thank you for watching, if you're still watching. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, or if you had any, uh, like if it helped you in any way, uh, please let me know, comment below, and like and subscribe. Thanks, see you guys next video.